Welcome back, everyone. Hey, I just met you. I like potatoes. Good to know. Okay, for each reference, that's not usually what your, your opening line is when you meet somebody. <laughs> well, it depends if you're going to go out and eat potatoes. Oh, if they're redundant. Irish, it's probably a, a pickup line. Uh, it's kind of redundant if, they're... if you're that's Irish. A, that's offensive, good. No, no, you're not Irish. They are. Like, hey, uh, I'm Polish, but I like potatoes too. Hey, I'm so Polish. We, we, we can make babies. Yeah, pierogies, babies. Pierogi babies. <laughs> What's the diff what? It's going on. Uh, okay, don't delicious. tell me you don't know what pierogies are. I don't know what a pierogi is. Okay, good. He's got to. He's European. I don't know what a pierogi is, is what I'm saying. You don't know. He does. No, He's a no Mr. America. No, what is it? He's lying right now. He Maybe we have a different name for it. Isn't that possible? Huh? I speak a different language. Did you guys realize? Huh? I, can, I cannot teach you every single culinary thing that exists. Holy oh, well, you should, because I need to. Yeah, I am. Potato pocket. Big Benny Twenty Hour Lunt. You know what a pierogi is. Nay. The green flower. Garlic, too. red onion. Because everyone loves. It's like onion. a potato dumpling, kind of. Ugh. A potato dumpling? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. First of all, it sounds Italian. Second of all, no, not it's Italian. not. It's Polish. Why is it called pierogi? It's Polish? Yeah. Yeah. What's a pierogi, fellas? <laughs> <sighs> You're no, seriously! Oh, we just told you, it's a potato dumpling. What the f- what does that mean? You know, like ravioli? Imagine if it had potato inside of it. Yeah. Oh, like Just Rocky. Kinda. No, okay, but then where's it made from? Why do- why is Poland, Poland making pasta? Does it make any sense? It's not really. I mean, it's a pierogi. You just said it's like a raffioli with potato inside. That's the best way I know to describe it to you, the man who is an uncultured swine, who even though he lives in Europe doesn't know anything about the culture around him. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. Is you're American. Really really close to Poland. You shut your mouth. Well, you just. Second of all. Okay, you know, a Google search on pierogi would do wonders right now. First of all. I'm streaming. You, you cannot Google while streaming. No. Google, Google can't either. He has to use his phone. I, I cannot. I do it all the time while streaming. Recording is a little different. Yeah, see? He's recording. You're not. You don't know what YouTube is. See, I have Dutch people in my chat. He's like, they're saying, no idea. What the hell are you talking about? You're, you're assuming that whole Europe is one thing and that we all know each other. You should. Uh -uh. How do you not know? What do you know mean you should? I'm making any sense. Is, was that a burp? That's a <laughs> It's my response to your unculturedness. What do you mean? <laughs> okay. How do you spell it? P E R O G I? Pierogi? Sounds about right. Might not be exactly right, but it's close enough. You look like dumb. Should, should get you there. Yeah. Uh, Progi is the name of a degerecht that vooral gegeten wordt in Polen, Wit-Rusland, Rusland, Ukraine, the Baltic Landen, Tsjechië, Slowakije, and other Slavic Landen. God, he's summoning Satan. <laughs> um, okay, so first of all, it's like it's a it's a dish that's like two thousand miles away from me, maybe a thousand. So it's pizza. Uh, all of Europe isn't even two thousand miles. Why? What do you mean? So it's pizza? It's a little well, different. Pizza background. does not exactly originate in the same place that you live. Yeah, well, we don't get frozen pierogies for dinner here as students, okay? You should. Really? They're delicious. Yeah, they're delicious. No. Yeah. no. Yeah. No, it just... You guys... You guys... Are... Naive. You guys are naive. Naive? Naive? What's a naive? You guys are naive. Is it like a na nipple? No, you guys are naive. Like navel? This is what, this is... navel and a nipple. Did you Mine? say dick? We're Did naive. You, dick? you didn't know what a ni you didn't know what a pierogi was. <laughs> Did you say <laughs> dick? Nipple. <laughs> this happens all the time. I make a very good point, and you guys are like, "Ooh, he said it weird. Ooh, so European." <laughs> yeah, you said naive. Okay, that is actually. I said naive. Word. Oh, I'm sorry that my accent is coming up. I'm sorry. I'm so language man. Okay. Okay. You're okay. So okay. For, first man. of all. Okay. First of all, it is naive. Second. Nave makes you sound like a knave because Nave is a simpleton. Didn't I just correct myself to naive and you're still on about yeah, it? Yeah, but you're, then you're saying like, uh, well, Mr. Picker. Yeah, you said Nave. Of course we're picking on you. Well, I'm sorry, Mr. Mr. Red 
Packers. <laughs> Mean? I meant naive, <laughs> and yes, y'all are naive to think that Europeans are as cohesive as well. Well, that's not really true either. But whatever. I'm sorry, I don't know what's happening in Poland right now. I mean, but it happened in Poland like 300 years ago or something like that, and it's oh yeah, it's well, a widely maybe... accepted dish across all of the world now. Uh, well, I'm sorry, but not in my household, Mr. Gee. Maybe you should trust some pierogies. Yeah, maybe I should, huh? Yeah, I'm glad we can agree. I'm glad we could educate you some. Yeah, hashtag Arcus Abroad, fund me. <laughs> you don't even have to oh. go that far. You just go to the grocery store. Why did I get some bread and put some soup in it? It's very possible it's not even in our grocery store. I it's, bet it, it is. I bet you it isn't. I bet maybe there's like a there's like a like a recipe to bake them, but you can't just buy pierogies in the store. It's, I can guarantee it. I don't believe it. Okay, uh, everybody, get good to the Netherlands. I'll, just, I'll show him. <laughs> I will solve. I don't want to come to the Netherlands to prove you wrong. That's how bad I want to prove you wrong right now. I don't think you're right. You're on every. Oh well, I'm very. I'm very glad that you are the expert of my country. <laughs> you don't even know where you live. You're all the time talking about Amsterdam. Boy, well, mm, I want to. I want. <laughs> I want to grab water on me. This, I'm gonna throw some water at you when you come here. You're just gonna give me a I'm bath. Gonna, I'm gonna I see be you. on. Um, we're gonna be on this special episode of uh, Hello Goodbye on Schiphol, and I'm gonna throw water at you, and it'll be a super good episode on the TV here. Did you say what? What'd you call the show? Hello Goodbye. It's, on it's, Sir it's, Poland. Don't talk to me. <laughs> what did you say? Did you say Sir Poland? I don't. I did not say Sir Poland. This is not like Miss America or whatever. What did you this... say? You said on or it wasn't Sir. It was like Zer Poland or Zerpoland. <laughs> what are you talking about? You said something about Poland. I never mentioned Poland in the last five minutes. You said oh, we on hello goodbye on and what was the next word? Oh, skip hole. What yeah, is that? Pole. What a stripper pole. Schiphol, also known as Amsterdam yeah. Airport, for people who are not cultured and can't. They do hello goodbye in an airport? Are all your television shows recorded in an airport? No, just hello <laughs> goodbye, it's weird. <laughs> <laughs> what? You have a show recorded purely in the airport? Yeah, and it's just a guy. I've, I've seen it recorded live, because sometimes when I come back, I, I see the whole camera crew and the guy who hosts it. And they're just walking around seeing if they can talk to someone who, who has a story because they're traveling. That's the whole. That's the whole thing. They just you should give them people. your story. You should be like, "I'm going to find pierogies abroad." It's like it, it, it's like chat on the street, but a lot worse. <laughs> uh, Do they lay down on the ground? Like chat? No, they just interview people, and it's not. It's not even funny. At least chat on the street is good comedy, but this is different. It's not. It's just. This is like, oh hey, yo, you're going to a different uh, country. Haha, -ha, wow, what you gonna do there? That's it. <laughs> You should get on an episode. Yeah, it's gonna be you and me, and I'm gonna throw stuff in your face. This whole episode. Wow. Yeah. Me, <laughs> <sighs> Narcus. That's right. I think Joris Linsen hosts it. That's that could be his name. I, I'm not gonna trust uh, my trusty viewers on this. You talk. You tell me. <sighs> you guys are uncultured. You're so angry right now. I'm not angry, I'm... You're pretty angry. Okay. What did you do with the uh, plant growing thing, Nebris? The plant growing thing? Yeah, the thing that's supposed the to be done. The phytogenic isolate. Yes. It's probably in the system. Recipe disabled makes farming too trivial, it says. <laughs> I love that it says that. I'm glad I made this before the recipe got disabled. Mm -hmm. Yes, in in English, the airport is, is also called uh, Schiphol or Shiphole. But these <laughs> have. Uh... Well, you can't say that, actually. Can we say it? Can we? No, oh, no, wait. wait no, Are you going to make an exception for this man? No. Pat. I think we can say the S word, can't we? No. No, we can't. Okay. No. Did, we'll clap. Did, did we just clap? Well, he said it in a different language. <laughs> no, okay. no, you clap, bitch. Well, you clap. Hey, you can't say that. Okay. Oh, yes, okay. you can. 
I can call you female dog anytime I want. Woof woof. We're we're going into the semantics of what the how how swearing works again. We've had like twenty episodes on this topic. Yes, I remember I, all the yes. words we could say. I never thought we could say damn. Okay, I'm still learning. <laughs> well, what about Amsterdam? I can't see even do the. Well, Maybe that's a know. word. That's like it's okay. different. Yeah, well, I'm gonna say this, and you are not allowed to abuse it. If a if a word is part of another word that is allowed, it is okay. Like shiitake mushrooms are okay, are obviously okay because you need to be able to reference the name. I can't say blank taki mushrooms. It doesn't work like that. So obviously, if the word if the s word is part of another language and that le- and in that word is not swearing, obviously I'm not going to bleep it. You um, have, we have new loophole. I, uh, <laughs> I said you are not allowed. Um, anyway, um, good bitch, you gotta clap for Pack Rat. There you go. We said a lot worse since then. How's he gonna know where we left off the where? Where? where... Okay, a double clap. Uh, chip hole. <laughs> uh, we, we could just use uh, chip hole to refer to. <laughs> Places that are in certain states. A state of trip. State Get of it? Being. Yeah. Just masquerade it. Like a masquerade ball? Sure. I actually would really like to like show you my country, uh, good. Would you? But um, I would. But then again, you're still on about this stupid Norway thing. <laughs> I always want to go to Norway. Will you, ta- will you take me? No. No. Oh. I thought we were going to see each other's country. You know what? You can just stay where you are. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Harsh. Right. I know, right? We were we were coming together. We were going to break the bonds. Well, I, I've, I've been bonding with my country a lot lately, and I need to... It's my... It's my... I have a king. His name you is have Willie. a king? We have a Dude. king. His name, his name is Willie, and this is this is this is, this is actually this is actually true. And uh, so you have, you have a king named Willie. Yeah, yeah Willie, Willie the orange. That's right. Willie, Willie the orange. Is he like the king of the? Um... He's got a. He's got orange hair too. King Willie. We have uh, an orange-haired king too. His no, no he's, his hair's not orange. Orange skinned. Yeah. I thought he was God Emperor. Yeah. He well, was yeah, say he's, he's God, God Emperor. Emperor. Right. <laughs> Emperor King. Yeah. Ex- extreme dictator. Are they both Oompa Loompas, do you think? No, our last name is orange. Lot. He's not he's not like physically orange. Oh. So we have we have the only Oompa Loompa King. Yes. Hmm. Well, that's pretty cool that we have that in common. Well, we don't, though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't we? The cool thing is, ours can read. Really? He does Maybe it like every... Uh... Ours can tweet. Um, yeah. He does, no, he does the... Uh, he does the uh, raid op uh, Prinsjesdag. Um, which is always Ooh, the most girl, exciting thing ever. You prism for those kind of words. What? Troonraid op Prinsjesdag? My God, Arcus! Mm. Clap. <laughs> uh, good. You're you're acting like a skip hole right now. Clap. Yeah, I think so. Hello, goodbye. Like Thanks it. for watching, everybody. We're gonna continue this episode because we're not done yet. <gasps> Went weed, wool of bat. So I get a bunch of weed. Oh my god. What do you go, my god? <laughs> Becky, look at her butt. Yes. It is so big. <clears throat> I'm going to speak a lot more Dutch now to kind of like drill in the fact that Kit's an idiot. <laughs> I, I am impressed that people from your country learn <laughs> all the languages of the, the neighboring countries. It's really yeah. cool. That you yeah, guys do that. but we're, but we're still the uncultured, right? Yeah, I mean, it is it is a shame that you are so uncultured. Whenever you have yeah. such 
Did I put the wrong thing in here? Well, we came up with Sesame Street, so haha. No, that's Spanish moss. You that might be true. <laughs> you... No, you didn't. <laughs> well, we came up with Bossy and Adrian, so haha. Suck it all. Is that done? I've never heard of that one, so I'll stick with, you know, the original. Oh, it can only be crafted in the dream world. I messed up. I'm an idiot. Oh, oh I hate yeah, to do that thing. Oh, crap. Jar of garbage. Thank you. Man. Bloop, bloop. Isn't a kettle hard to make? I have to bring bloop. my kettle to the dream world. This is ridiculous. Bloop, bloop. You all right there, Harkus? This isn't so bad. I guess I can make another call. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> Are you done? I'm done now. Thanks. <laughs> was there another cable song that I just missed? It, this was a chisel song. <laughs> I'm special. Um, alright. I won't do a wireless transmitter song. Because I am merciful. Let's see, that is 12. Good. What? What's that word? Wow, this transmitter? No, mur... Murderous? What? Mur... Myrtle? Myrtle. The turtle. <laughs> what was my backpack? No? X? No. B? Well, no. No. I changed mine to C. I don't know what yours is. C? Oh? Mm, no. Oh crap, but I changed my bar. B? Um, e? No. I? Yeah! <laughs> uh oh, oh that's my ring of magnetization, is that? Uh oh. Found it. Hmm. Okay. I really don't want to go to the dream world right now, so we'll do that later. Oh, you don't want to take a nap? Uh, no. Call me a werewolf. If I walk up on this woman as a wolf, she'll accept. You still oh, have trouble with that word, don't you? What? Wolf. Wolf? <laughs> <laughs> That's the sound your mother made like. Wow. <laughs> wolf. 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 You okay? Isn't, isn't that Wolf. Dutch for like a uh, hunk of iron or something? No. Wolf is wolf. W O L F. Wolf. Wolf. What do, what do you call blooms of iron? A bloom of iron. Oh, I'm sorry. Obviously, I know that word. Don't oh. use it in your language. Uh, I think it's uh, Frikandel. That's not English. No, just ask for a Dutch word. <laughs> Are you surprised? <laughs> now I'm curious. What, what word am I thinking of? It's gotta be Frikandel. No, no, I, I, it probably sounds like wolf. Um, it's it's wolf? unforged iron. Like, just smelted it from ore. Ember, wolf now. Wolf, Mister Wolf. I don't know what you're on about. What you're on about. This is, it's not my kind. It's not my language. Hammerslachtag? That's not a thing. How do we go to the dream world again? I don't even remember. You drink the potion of justice? Ah, uh, that's right. I guess don't that, don't I? I'm glad you weren't doing that right now. Well, 
don't have anything else to do. <laughs> I might as well just go ahead and do it. Go with me. What does it feel like to have nothing to do? I, mean, I got plenty to do. I saw you forgot to make these witches talk to me. But I'm kind of giving up on that for the day. Almost out of time for the day. In fact, we are out of time for the day. Sure yeah. so I guess Thanks for the watching. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Bye. All right. Bye. Bye. Bye.